All right, day one, 100 kettlebell swings a day. Uh, did 30 pounds on the T-handle. I got the T-handle idea from Tim Ferriss from 4-Hour Body. And it's basic construction. Uh, he says it's under 20 bucks or whatever in the old blog post, but plumbing equipment has gotten a lot more expensive, so it cost me about 35 to uh, put it together. Uh, but I think I made the thing too long because if I am lazy, um, I scrape it on the ground. So I hate that. But I'm going to use this. Uh, i got to weigh it. But I'm going to use this uh, umbrella holder full of sand that uh, I got last time I got an umbrella. And then... Uh, uh, hopefully that's going to make it a little bit more weighty. The current stack is 30 pounds. The 100 swings was relatively easy. Uh, I think I need to up the weight a little bit, but I also don't want to super fatigue my low back because tomorrow is deadlift day. So um, I'm going to start adding on to the T-handle 5-pound increments until it gets ridiculously hard and then just keep up the 100 swings a day until um, the end of the uh, thing so uh, day one in the books complete uh, tomorrow we do a little punching bag a little jujitsu a little uh, swinging these again and then Medi's 5x5 five five. we're doing deadlifts overhead presses and squats uh, and then we'll use this little rack I just put into the garage and uh, crush it. Also, my coach James from Five Fit Training, he told me to get some barefoot shoes because he said my running shoes, if I try to lift in them, it's going to keep my, um, because it elevates my ankles, it's going to keep my... Um, my glutes, my, uh, sorry, my glutes, my, uh, gastroc and, uh, the, the Achilles tendon, it's going to keep it super short, uh, because it pitches me forward as I'm doing squats or doing kettlebell swings or whatever. So I ended up getting these shoes right here and, uh, um, I like them so far. So they give me a good, um, uh, flat thing on the ground. Let's me spread my toes out. It gives me a little bit better balance than my other shoes do. And uh, so, yeah, I'll give you better reviews on that as I start working on gastroc and Achilles flexibility. And that concludes day one of the Project Vanish Challenge. Uh, 100 kettlebell swings, uh, dealing with the barefoot shoes for the first time, and setting up all the punch and pad stuff for tomorrow. Uh, tomorrow we'll do Medis 5x5 and uh, do some jiu -jits. So I'll take you on a little video journey of that. Until then, stay awesome.